Welcome back to BT Minecraft, but we're starting in the nether. <laughs> Let's kick some ender dragon lasagna. So I ran away from the portal because I hate the sound. I looked around and then I continued on my way. But as always, I get distracted by stupid things. So this happened. Okay. Mojang, why is the flower floating? Just a question. A, a very nice question. Is it just a general? A white water? Is it night already? Anyway. Anyway, life is great, isn't it? No, it is. Anyway. I didn't say tomato shit. after I had a meltdown I got some wood and then I made some wooden planks then chest and then placed everything that I had in my inventory in the chest after that I got what I needed and then I started killing sheep but as everything in my life loves to go wrong so did this mobs just came out of nowhere so I started killing them and continued killing sheep too because I need wool to make a bed but more mobs just came out of nowhere you know where this is going my health got so low that I had to book it out of there and I continued running and met a creeper but I managed to get away after that I started eating but minecraft loves to harass me so a spider attacked me I murdered the spider but I was so pissed that I turned to a maniac I managed to get three wool pieces to make a bed, so I got the wood from the chest and made a bed and ran to a safe place to sleep. When I woke up, I was surprise greeted by a zombie that almost took my life, but my brain did react fast enough. I went to my chest and got some food and returned to break the bed. After that, I continued killing more sheep and found a skeleton in the pond. I got pissed. So I decided to burn the forest. I almost burned myself twice. Then I started dancing. After that, I watched the beautiful scenery from afar. Then I went to my chest and took what I needed. And then I went to look for a cave. I met some pigs on the way. I killed them. Met some goats on the way. And I killed them. Then I saw more goats and said, Do you drop anything? Like, I know I've killed two, but I'm just making sure. Making sure. No, I'm just making. No, not yet. No. Minecraft? You wouldn't put a useless mob. No, 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 no. You wouldn't put a useless mob. Right? I found some caves, but I saw some sheep at the distance, so I went to kill them. Then I went to explore the caves. In cave number one, nothing. Cave number two, nothing. And of course, while I was killing a skeleton, my axe broke. But it wasn't a problem. I just used my pickaxe. Cave number three, nothing. I made some furnaces and then went to get some coal to cook some food. I ate some food and went to explore more caves. And as always, nothing. I returned to make more tools, but a baby zombie attacked me, so I killed him and then went to explore more caves. I went in a cave and found a skeleton spawner. I got in, but I forgot to break the spawner. And because of that, I almost died. I ate, then I killed the skeleton, went to break the spawner, but before it broke a skeleton spawn. I looted the place and got out. I found a big cave, so I went in and found some iron at the entrance, so that was a good sign. I continued mining and mining till an emerald and an ocelot. I don't know why Rich. the fuck I called it an ocelot. Anyway, I made a bucket and then took the axolot. After that, I made an iron pick and mined the gold and then continued exploring more of the cave. While I was exploring the cave, I found... Is that diamonds? Yes, it is diamonds. I took the diamonds and got greedy and continued exploring more of the cave. Then I found diamonds! Ouch. So as everyone saw, sometimes being greedy is good. Then I heard... 
Minecraft, aren't you a hummingbird? Kids game that I found diamonds. I continued exploring and found more diamonds, but I got jump scared. <gasps> I got the diamonds and decided to get out, so I mined straight up. I got out, killed a pig, and went back to get the things that I've left. I went to sleep, then in the morning, I got going to my chests. I saw the fire, so I got down and went to my chest. I got what I needed, smelted the iron, and made a flint and steel. I didn't know what to do with the diamonds, so I took a moment to think. I have decided to make diamond armor, then I wore it. Then I made more things, killed Mr. Zombie and named my eggs, lot of more. Then I killed more mobs, made a platform, and started killing them. And while I was killing them, a creeper exploded. I acted like nothing happened and continued killing Endermen. Then I returned to our old friend, the Nether. I killed some hoglins, then I rode a strider, then I started singing. We're going, going, going to find a nether fortress. We're going, going, going to find a nether fortress. I'm so sorry that you heard that. Anyway, after a long, long journey, I found a fortress. <gasps> a fortress! Oh my god. It's been a long time. A long, long time I was going to go to sleep, but... It looks like I'm high, but trust me, I'm not. I was only awake for 18 hours. I drank a potion of fire resistance, found some chests, got the diamond and the gold, and found a blaze spawner. So I started killing them. I got out, then I started looking for piglets. Then I found some and started trading with them. And like always, I got nothing. I found a ruined portal, so I got the gold armor from the chest and the gold luck. After that, I got traded with a piglin, got nothing, almost killed myself, but I did not. I started mining up so I can get to a warp forest, but I fucked up. I panicked and ran out of there. And then I got to the portal, got some gold blocks, and went to the ocean to get some water. After that, I returned and traveled for miles to get there. And... I didn't find him. I was so sad and angry, so I took it out on the Enderman. After I got all the Ender Pearls, I rode my strider and gone to the portal. But on my way there, I fat up. <gasps> I made an iron helmet and then burned the force again. <laughs> I made my sweet Cor a gold grave and went to get him friend and called him Coral to got what I needed and went to look for the stronghold. In this journey, I killed more animals, got iron from the ravine, killed more mobs, found a ruined portal, then killed more animals, lost two ender eyes, and killed more animals, and made a bucket, then burned a sapling. Just wanted to make sure that you don't drop anything, so nothing personal. You don't drop anything. Maybe, maybe, maybe you will drop something? Maybe you will? Maybe? No, you don't. Hmm. <sighs> Mojang, we're gonna have a talk. You're going to die soon, but not now. I love picking a fight with everyone. Anyway, I found the stronghold, and then I started looking for the portal. Then I found it. I got in, broke the spawner, placed the ender eyes, and went to look for one more perk. I realized that the stronghold was in a ravine. I fought mobs, explored till I found Enderman number one. And as you guessed, nothing. I found it just nothing. Almost died. Found another library, then a zombie apocalypse happened, so I dropped myself using iron doors, then started killing them. After that, I explored more of the stronghold and found a creeper that knows how to use the ladders. After a long time, I finally got an enderpearl. I returned to the portal, made beds, organized my inventory, then it was time for battle. Let's kick some ender dragon. Time to turn some music on. Lasagna.
There is one thing that we had to do. And now everyone will rest in peace. I hope you have enjoyed the video. If you did, please press the like button and subscribe to see more of my crazy personality. And see you soon. Bye bye.